So at the moment, uh, Vector Health, we're advertising for a strength and conditioning coach slash or an exercise scientist. So the role is a fairly diverse role. So if you're interested in working with athletes in a long-term athletic development context in a school setting and then private clients, then this role is a really good role, especially for an experienced level one coach who's looking to go into or study into that level two um, professional setting. So in the last, say, 10 years and working with this particular school and the, and the clients that we've worked with, um, you know, you get to work with your rugby and your rugby league athletes in the Confraternity Shield program, the Ballymore Cup um, style arrangement, so from opens right down to sort of under 14 level. So it's a really good opportunity for you to have or be part of a program that, where you can see developing from a younger age all the way to the finish of high school. And then in terms of private clients, they can range from, um, for example, you know, a, a young rower that's got some issues with movement patterning that you need to fix and to help them with so that they can perform at the highest possible level. Um, it, it could be a runner, it could be, there's a really nice diversity of sports that we work with. We have a big uh, focus in our programming around swimming. So we work with one swimming club and a, and, and a few other swimming athletes. And, and then in other sports, uh, sports like netball, so quite a few individual netball athletes and then some clubs and um, some schools that we work with. So um, in terms of the role itself, it's very much around, we provide as much support as you need. So if you're coming to us as an experienced level one, what we'd like to see you develop into is a great level two coach. And that just means that your level of programming, your level of, um, you know, supervision, your control within your group settings, the way that you go about your role, we want to see that improve so that you then can make, you know, the next step up into the next level, um, you know, semi-professional, professional sport. But the grounding that you get working with teenage athletes and helping them develop is probably one of the most important parts of starting in a strength and conditioning context. It's a, it's a you know, working in schools and with young younger Athletes is a captive market. They're there to learn and you're there to teach and you're there to inspire their performance improvements. So Vector Health, like just to explain then a little bit more about our business if you're not, uh, if you're not familiar. So we're an integrated allied health and performance coaching model. Uh, we developed that model around 10 years ago. So our business has been going for 13 years. We've got a team of, of between 26 to 28 people, and they range from exercise, sauna, strength and conditioning, through to physio and soon to be occupational therapy as well. So it's a very, very diverse team that works. We work with a range of people. So then in terms of if you're an exercise scientist, we don't just have to put you in the pigeonhole of an SNC environment, we can put you with other clients. You know, you can work within the NDIS model, you work in private clients, with different conditions so that you get more exposure to a wider variety. So really depending on your experience is probably where the role takes you. Um, but what we're looking for is someone that's a self-starter, someone that can work autonomously, but it's not afraid to work as part of a big team and not afraid to ask questions and not afraid to be vulnerable in the moment in terms of the way and, and wanting to learn. Um, and someone that's really good at communication, good at supervision, wants to work with that younger age group because that is the predominant part of the role as it sits right now. Um, someone that's, you know, our, our, our mission is to transform self-belief, physical capacity with unrivaled care, and it doesn't matter who we work with. Um, we've been lucky enough at Vector to have, for example, the Australian rowing team train with our facility twice. And in terms of the feedback garnered from those, like people at that highest level about the care that we take, you know, we want to see that, you know, an, an Australian team come in our facility and they can feel looked after just the same as one of our Special Olympics athletes who walks into the gym, not able to achieve what she wants to be able to achieve and then walk away being able to win gold at a, at a world championship level. So it doesn't matter who we work with, what we want to see is we do that with a level of care that the person that you're working with has never experienced before. So if that's something you're interested in, then we'd invite you to apply through the link provided um, in the video here. Thanks.